Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. My name's Noelle and I review and unbox subscription boxes here on my channel. Today I am just so excited to welcome this box back to the channel. I think I opened two seasons a couple of years ago and then we sort of lost track of each other, but I did reach out to them recently and they were kind enough to send me their summer box for review. Now I believe that this summer Norse box is all sold out, but they're probably already taking orders for the next one and of course I do have a code for you but let me give you all the details first since it has been a while since we've had this great lifestyle box here on the channel so it is $71 per quarter plus $15 in shipping and then any applicable sales tax in your state whatever that might be and then let me just read you the description each Norse box will feature one to five seasonal items from designers valued at 80 to $100 so you're definitely getting your money's worth but sometimes there might just be one hero item in there. The boxes will progress around the home to give each room a fresh Scandinavian update. And you guys know I love my Scandi style. It's contemporary, it's modern, it's clean, but it also has those elements of Huga, of inviting nature in, a mixture of textures. Love, love, love it. And also just beautiful functional design, which we also really appreciate for those of you like me who might live in kind of smaller spaces. The mission of Norse Box is to spread the joy of Scandinavian design and lifestyle. With posts in Sweden and Denver, we source designs directly from Scandinavia, but ensure a seamless shipping process. I think that is awesome as well. Simple but functional products, appreciating the beauty of raw materials. So that is the whole aesthetic. That's the whole mission. I absolutely love it. The code that I've got for you is just my name, Noel, N-O-E-L, and that will save you 40% on your first box, which I think that is pretty generous. So if you guys like what you see, if you love Scandi style, if you want to just a little contemporary update in different areas of your home because they kind of work around the home, I think this might be a box that you want to consider. Please let me know too if you want to keep seeing it on the channel. I'm not sure if they'll always be able to send it to me. If anyone at Norse Box is watching this, please by all means, I would love to open this on my channel consistently because it is something that I really, really love and I think a lot of my viewers will love it as well. So the box, also very simple. It just had some big old fragile stickers on it and then a shipping label on top. So didn't have much to share with you in the thumbnail, but inside, of course, we have a product card and lots of chic black shred so here it is love that and then on the other side it tells us a little bit about the theme as well as the items and it does look like we have four items this time around remember one to five so I'm gonna prop this up in front of me and then I don't see anything peeking out of there, do you? I think everything is hidden in there, so I'm gonna have to do some digging. So let me go ahead and start to uh, go through that process. Oh goodness, there is a lot of shred for me to uh, slowly remove. Let's see if I can just kind of move a little bit of it over, but you know, I, I do love the unpacking process. All right, I got the top layer off, so now we can finally see some of those treasures that are packed inside. So it says, experience the essence of Norwegian summer with the summer 2023 Norse box. So we have like a Norway theme here. Our summer collection features carefully curated items from Nordic Fox. That's the brand. It says, uh, including scented candles, <laughs> bonus points there, you guys know I love a candle, crafted with natural ingredients and fragrances that embody the tranquility of the season. Enjoy the soothing aroma of fresh pine, ooh, or the delicate scent of wildflowers as you read our Le Leifse book filled with stories and anecdotes about the tradition of making Leifse a Norwegian flatbread. So I'm not sure if it's got stories or recipes or maybe a combination of the two. It's very interesting because we had another sort of Nordic themed box that also had a book in it this this time around so I'm very curious to see um, let's see I'm just gonna go ahead and see if I can pull some items out of the shred so that we have somewhere to go with everything so I do I'm kind of recalling some of the items that I've gotten from Norse box in the past which did include um, some really gorgeous um, woven placemats one time but also I've definitely gotten some really cool candles from them too so I'm just trying to dig around in here there's something flat on the very bottom luckily protected from all that black shred with some 
wrap, but let me just make sure. I think I've got everything out of there, but just in case, uh, I have my handy dandy little microfiber to clear off some of that black dust. I love black shred, but I will say that it does leave black dust on everything, so you have to be prepared for it. Um, and I have to clean this office pretty much every time I do an unboxing. All right, so we have, it says, we have an eight ounce candle. It says the summer peach candle or the delicate blend of birch, pine, cherry blossom, and jasmine from the wildflower and birch candle, both perfect for filling your home with the aromas of the outdoors. So there was some variation there. So I'm trying to see which one I got. So it looks like maybe it's one of these. Maybe I got both. Oh, maybe everybody got both. Let's see. So it does say summer peach and wildflower and birch. Okay, so very well wrapped, but I'm gonna have to get into it with my scissors. Um, Cause definitely these are the fragile items, but it looks like they made it in good condition. And I, I do think it's kind of nice that they're able to ship from Denver to those of us here in the States. So let's see. Sorry, you're gonna get some of those unpacking noises, but I know some of you are like me and you kind of enjoy that so that it's like unpackaging and real uh, having the experience in real time. All right, ooh, okay. So here is our Wildflower and Birch. It is an eight ounce soy candle, It's which is pretty big, right? A lot of times in boxes, we just get like a four ounce soy candle. So love that, love the simplicity of it. It is again from the company Nordic Fox Design Company. Oh, that is nice. That is really, really nice. Delicate blend of birch, pine, cherry blossom, and jasmine. And it has just a hint of sweetness in it, but not too sweet. You guys know I can't do the super sweet scents. That is, oh, that is lovely. That is so good. That's a really nice, I get a lot of candles, you guys. That's one that I would get again, honestly. All right, let me go ahead and open this one up because I think that we might have gotten both of them. So. That was the wildflower and birch. And then we have summer peach, which man, in terms of scents, like a fresh peach, like a really good one, which I didn't grow up with in Hawaii because we just the peaches, once they transit across the ocean, they, just, they either come really overly ripe or um, they have not ripened enough. And so I never really understood why people love a good juicy peach until I got started living on the mainland. I was like, oh, that's what peaches are supposed to taste like. That's very different. Yes. So we have our bubble wrap on the outside and then paper on the inside. And here is summer peach. So I cannot believe we got two candles. I'm so excited. And both scents sound amazing. <sighs> okay. Oh, that is nice. It is not too sweet. It is not that artificial peach scent that you get a lot of the times which can just be a little bit too cloying especially when they like try to make it like peach pie and then it's got like too much of that sugar in it that is light and peachy and amazing i don't know which one's my favorite i think i, I maybe the wildflower and birch one just because it is a blend but oh my gosh that smells so good now it makes me want a peach ah that's awesome okay i didn't know do they have peaches in norway they must. They must have peaches in Norway. All right. Then we have something. It says fjord and woodland gnome. I'm like, we got a woodland gnome. <gasps> we got more candles, you guys. Oh my gosh. This is like a candle box. This is amazing. <laughs> it's all from Nordic Fox. So we got the two eight ounce ones and then we got two four ounce ones. First, I thought we were going to have a woodland gnome and I got a little bit excited in all honesty. I don't know what a woodland gnome is supposed to smell like though. Okay. So this is Fjord, which I would like to go and visit the fjords once again. So let's see, it says, enhance your home's atmosphere with either the refreshing ocean mist and bergamot of the Fjord candle. Ugh, ocean mist, anytime it says like ocean mist or ocean breeze, it's got that really fresh outdoorsy scent and then with a little bit of bergamot to give it that little bit of floral. Mm. Ooh, that's not what I expected at all. Definitely has a little, yeah, that, that's a really unique scent in a good way. It definitely has that fresh ocean mist scent that's kind of familiar. And then the bergamot, the fjords, if the fjords smell like that, even more so. But what I'm really curious about, of course, is the gnome, because we've got a woodland gnome. It says, or the woodsy notes of pine, amber, and oak. Ooh, woodsy scents with a little depth with the amber and the woodland gnome candle. Oh, that's good too. Oh, that makes me think of like when we get into like the wintry scents, right? Those like, 
if you can't actually go forest bathing, you burn those candles, those evergreen scents. The pine is so good. It's not too heavy on the amber, which I know can be a little bit strong sometimes. That is, that is every single scent, you guys, is awesome. All four of them. They're all awesome. I do not mind that we got four candles. I know some of you would be like, I don't want four candles. They are all in my like scent profile and they're all very different. That's awesome. That's lovely. So we got summer peach, little fruity, wildflower and birch, like this really great blend, you guys. So, so good. A uh, tiny hint of sweetness, the ocean mist and bergamot, a fjord, and then the woodland gnome, pine, amber, and oak. So I guess the gnomes live in the woodlands, so they smell like the woodlands, which is fantastic. But there's more that's not candles. All right, so we got this Lefse Day Book, which this is what I have to kind of wipe off because it's got a little bit of... Um, a little bit of shred dust on it. It says, a simple story celebrating the tradition of making lefse, which again is a Norwegian flatbread, which I have visited Norway. I don't recall eating that. I did try some reindeer, which sad for Rudolph, but delicious. Um, let's see, Lefse Day by Heidi Smith and Kari Throop. Carry Throop. So this is interesting. So inside it says, thank you for buying our book. So it's got a little story. And then it looks like it's just going to be like a story about dry for Emily, our left maker in training. So it's just the story. Farmers grow potatoes on their farms. And then we just have these really pretty like drawings. How cute. And then we have, find out of the whole process. So very much farm to table. We learn all about this. So the, today is a special day. It's Lefse Day. It's a family tradition to make Lefse, a traditional Norwegian flatbread. So the, how cute. So it's a little bit like a children's book for sure. I'm wondering if it actually has the recipe in there because it's talking about moving it, you know, to, uh, to the table, to cool and organize in piles. So it looks like, yes, we did get, so they're like little like roll ups, little flatbread roll ups almost. So let's see, we do have grandma's left the recipe in the back, which, oh, so it's their like flatbreads made out of potatoes. That sounds amazing. So it says six cups mashed russet potatoes. I have never met a potato I didn't like. Uh, so this is a new form of potato, so I'm into it. Two teaspoons salt, one teaspoon sugar, so a little sweet and savory, three cups flour, and one cup butter. So it's just like a potato bread. How cool, and then you roll it out, and then you bake it, and then you serve rolled with butter, sugar, or other toppings. So it's like, it's like a Norwegian tortilla. That sounds so cool. I've never even heard of it, but I just think this is a really sweet little thing. All right, and then we do have one final item. So we had a total of six items. We had four candles, that cute little book, and then this little greeting card. It says it's a Scandi greeting card. Oh, I love it though. So it's, it's really cute. So it says the Scandi greeting card is a minimalist and stylishly designed card featuring clean lines, muted colors, and a heartfelt message. So it just has this nice little craft brown um, envelope. It's again, everything is from Nordic Fox design company, except for maybe this, maybe this one is not from there. Um, so it says, hello, hello, hala. <laughs> we just have some fish and it's got like this salmon color on the back. I assume it's salmon cause it's fish card. And then it's just blank on the inside, but it's a really well-made card. It would be like a really cute, uh, little framed print as well. And it is nice card stock. So you could definitely do that. So I'm going to have to be on the lookout more for Nordic Fox design company, because I really like what they did. And it seems like they have a lot of different items because they've got candles as well as greeting cards. Uh, I think that's really cool. So what a fun box uh, to enjoy. And so definitely something you could enjoy. Oh no, this is also published by Nordic Fox Design Company. So it was a whole box by one maker, which I kind of think is cool sometimes. Uh, and you guys know I am not opposed to having all candles, but you know, for the next one, it's going to be completely different, but still have that really clean, beautiful aesthetic. So if you are looking into it, Again, that code, Noelle, will get you 40% off on your first box, which I think is awesome. I love every single candle scent, and I cannot say that about all of the candles that I get to review and receive in boxes, but the uh, descriptions of the candles, I will say the scent notes, you know, I wouldn't be able to pick them out myself, but when I did read them, I could smell all of those in the candles, so good descriptions, great blends, nothing too strong. We'll have to see how the throw is, but I would say I think that that wildflower and birch is probably my favorite, but I also really, really love woodland gnome because this, these are so great, you guys. I'm so excited. 
<laughs> so excited to have Norris Box back on the channel as well. I hope you are too. If you could leave a thumbs up and a comment, I would truly, truly appreciate it. And hopefully I'll see you all very, very soon in my next unboxing.